In 2009, Dr. Kermser's gross pay was $381,318.60. What was her monthly gross pay? So we're going to take this amount right here. And we're going to divide that by 12. So I go $381,318.60. And I divide that by 12. $31,776.55. Okay. And what month did she hit the maximum taxable Social Security income? So I'm going to take the cap, which is what this is. Um, this is the maximum taxable income, maximum taxable income, MTI. And we're going to 106,800. And we're going to divide that amount by the monthly gross pay, 31,000. 776.55. So let's do that. 106, 106, 800 divided by the 31,776. And we get 3.36 months. So approximately 3.361 months. 3.361 months, okay? So you're all the way uh, January, February, March. So this is through March right here. And then we're into a part of April right here. Okay, so in February, you paid the full meal deal. So this is 6.2%, so 0 0.062 times 31,776.55. So let's do that, 0 0.062 times 31,776.55. So um, the doctor is going to pay $1,970.15 in February. Now in September, let's see, we've already paid it all. So she's going to pay zero in September because she's paid everything. All of the social security has been paid with by the time you get to April. So April, you're only taking, so that's only part of the month that we're paying for that. So that's the 0.361. So to find this amount, we're gonna take the 0.361. We're gonna take the 0 0.062 and the 31,776 point 55 multiply those three things together so we got 0 0.062 times 31,776.55 we got this so we're going to take we're going to multiply that by 0 0.361 0 0.361 so in April the doctor only has to pay $711.22